Welcome back to Rogue Legacy. You know what? I forgot to start my timer. Give me just a second here. Do -do 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 timer started. Okay. Welcome back to Rogue Legacy. Today we're going to be Sir Hornsby 2, the assassin. He is gigantism and ectomorph. So he's huge, but he's skinny. So every hit sends him flying. Uh, the assassins are the ones that can crit even though their stats are low. Um, they've gained the ability to go invisible. And damn, I haven't played this in a while and forgot how much gold I had. We might just upgrade the potions. Nope, we're going to upgrade how much gold we get. Okay. It costs 3,500. There we go. Oh man, all right, now, um, we get more gold and we pick up coins. Let's see, 540, 700, we're probably going to go with the mana upgrade. Yeah, we're going with the mana upgrade. There we go, we have more mana. That was actually pretty efficient use of the money. Almost all of it gets spent. Alright, we're still farming the first floor before moving on to the... There we go. See, each each coin's worth 13. Before moving on to the forest, because I still think it gives enough money to be worth it. Ow! I'm fucking huge. It's kind of obnoxious, actually. But I do have a giant sword. Yeah! Oh, and I can do this. So when needed, I can do the I am invisible, everything goes through me thing. Whee! Actually, look kind of awesome. And of course, we got the vampirism up, so. It's the kind of room you expected to be a treasure chest in, but no. Aha! <laughs> Using my skills and shit. I'm definitely really loving flight now that I've had more time to acclimate to it. I remember this game being like really hard. And it's like... Finding of Isaac is so hard that this is pretty easy now. What actually happens when I go invisible? Do I do I just take no damage? Let's find out. Nope, you still take damage. Okay. I was hoping you won into mist form. Well, that's a ow. What? Ow! I don't have enough to go back into mist form. This is all a hor horrible mistake, but I have learned how mist form works. I now know that you can't take damage while in it. It's just too bad. I guess it would be broken if it lets you like walk across spikes and shit, which is exactly what I was trying to do with it. Yeah, come on! Mm. I'm dying from stupid shit, but there's not... I mean, this is not a game about getting your health back. Fuck out of here, skeletons. See, I don't think they crit enough to be worth it. I much prefer the shinobis that just do tons of damage instead of critting sometimes.
Ooh, this is going very poorly. No! Ow. There was treasure right there. God damn it. Well, slain by a guard box. Alright, we're gonna be Lady Blair, the Barbarian King. She has Dextrocar Dextrocardia and OCD. Dextrocardia swaps your MP and your hit points. Okay. OCD is the one where you get mana back by breaking shit. We made a little bit of gold. Um, yeah, we're just gonna raise how much gear you can carry. <laughs> she has a ton of mana and no health because Barbarian with Dexter Cardaria. Okay. Well, fine then. We will use mana a lot. However, I don't think she has very good magic. Oh, she actually has more intelligence than strength. Okay. Yeah, we're. That's what we're doing. Ow! Holy shit! Almost dead already. <laughs> this was a terrible idea. Barbarian was not meant to have their shit swapped. There we go. You know, a little bit of gold. And we do have this blood sword, so we're slowly kind of gaining mana back. Mana! Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Alright, well. <laughs> go back in. We are Lady Lisa to the Barbarian Queen. She's nostalgic and an endomorph. She's very heavy. Enemies can't knock her back. Uh, I think we're going to raise our attack. Ooh, well, attack or magic damage. Our attack is up. And this is what nostalgia gives you. Everything that's kind of old-timey. Yeah, we'll go in next time. <laughs>